Okay, we're back. I've got water now. We are also on the links with water. Oh, we're just, we're we're just, just right starting. We're just going it. right, right cool. into You better write that timestamp yep, down right, real quick, it. buddy. Right. Here we go. Door of the Explorer. Num Crunch. Do raw. Mar Ma Mario Maker. Oh, wait. There's, I keep finding that. <laughs> Shit. Okay, so now we have our stairway. Our stairway to heaven. Ooh. Oh, God. They're in nope. Okay. Told you. I was really concerned. Oh! Shit. It's all right. Or it is... Oh! It goes up, okay. Ooh. Is there any way to, like, permanently kill those? Uh... Is it a star? Not a star. Oh, uh, you can do it oh. with a star. There are a couple of ways. I don't remember them all off the top of my head. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, 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 god. From past. Uh, oh, god, you have a choice to make. What's in the block? Hey! Uh, shroom. Let's do that. Oh no. Oh, okay. Well, now we know. So I guess, I guess now would be a good time as ever. Um, I took a trip to Virginia lately. Oh um, yeah? That was super cool. Um, it was for one of our, a good friend of ours. Uh, his name is Denton. Dentoni, Dentonian, Denty. Denton. 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 Uh, it was his 25th birthday, and his wife, who is also a really good friend of ours, uh, she's been fucking working on getting a cabin out in the middle of fucking nowhere for forever. And it was like, 10 of us. Oh, there you go. Oh, okay. All right. Sweet. Dura the Explorer. I think it's supposed to be Dora, because it's like door. No, nah, no, I'm totally uh, doing it. I'm totally saying Dura. Dura the Explorer. Dura. Dura. This light coming through your windows is like <laughs> shit right now. Is it? It is bright as fuck. Oh, no, I can't. And it's That's... right through the crack. Nope. Can't do anything about that. The final battle! Holy shit. Um, but yeah, Virginia. Um, no, it was really fucking, it was really fucking cool. Uh, we climbed, uh, Spy Rock, which I think you've said, you haven't, you haven't been to Spy Rock before. I have not been to Spy Rock. Because you do a lot of climbing, but. I want. But, oh god. But no, it was really fucking cool. We were out in nature all the time. Keto cloud. We just demolished our bodies with, you know, shame for the entire weekend. But it was a lot of fun, and like you got up to the top of Spy Rock, and like there's just nothing obstructing your view of the countryside around you, and like all the hills and mountains, and it was absolutely gorgeous. It just kind of like, oh, I'm, I'm being foolish. I'm <laughs> it, sorry. It just kind of like, I don't know. Growing up where we have, um, and you know, just basically having nothing around you, like nothing but like tiny little hills. Or otherwise, it's just like farmland everywhere and nothing else to do. It makes me really jealous for people who have grown up in like really geographically cool places. Yeah. Like, like people who are like who like live in Colorado. There you go. Holy shit. Nice. Um, but people who like have grown up in like Colorado or around like Nevada or places that just are way cooler than farmland makes me really jealous. Yeah, I guess it's like. I mean, it's worth pointing out that we piranice piranice passage. Um, it's worth pointing out that that you and I currently both live in Central Ohio, mm -hmm. um, but grew up in a much well. My area, I'm I'm from Pennsylvania, so yeah. my area is much more. Oh, it's an auto hilly. scroller. Uh, yeah. Um, so it's much more hilly. Mm -hmm. So I'm used to things like that, um, but neither of us are from. A town that was dumb. <laughs> a town that is like quite as city-like as right. Central Ohio. Yeah, no, we both now. grew up in very like, like rural a, areas. Yeah, big farm towns. So, um, how much do you think I need that coin? I think I think you absolutely need it. Um, because that you have that bar at the top, so you need to. Shit. Ooh, oh god! Shit. Oh god! Ah! Oh. Man, side scrollers are, are not my jam. Mm. Um. But, yeah, so anytime that I get to get outside to anywhere that isn't... Oh, I just oh, slid right the fuck off of there. That was, um, that was silly. I looked up for just a second and died. But any, anytime that I get to not be in the city mm -hmm. for a little while is really kind of a good time yeah. for me. Like, And I grew up in like the suburbs, mm -hmm. um, but very much like your traditional suburbia suburbs. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so it was like 
there was a cul-de-sac and there was a little park in the middle and I mean it wasn't like a, a fancy neighborhood by any rights but um ugh, fuck Ooh. this ice dude oh, my God. um but it was a uh here you go yeah like oh. shit. um but it, it wasn't like I'm nowhere I was nowhere near as close to a major city growing up as mm -hmm. I am now and right it takes us like 20 minutes to drive downtown if even yeah from here um and it was, I mean, it's an hour to Pittsburgh from where I'm from. Right. Going to the city was kind of a big deal. Mm-hmm. Shit. Ah. I'm just being dumb at this point. Um, so, yeah, like, any time that I get to go out, I mean, I do, I, I climb a lot. I do a lot of rock climbing and a lot of hiking and stuff like that. But any time that I, I get to not be in in the city or in downtown mm -hmm. and just kind of out and about is is what i consider a really good time so i'm super jealous of your trip to virginia oh, yeah. well and like one of the really cool things was like we were we were literally out in the middle of nowhere like there was nothing around us and fucking like at one point i think like halfway through virginia we like lost cell reception because we were in Appomattox, um which is kind of just i mean i'm not i think it's it's relatively central virginia but we're like we, we, everybody lost cell reception. And to, even though there's so many people out there, they're like, oh, millennials can't survive without their cell phones. It was really nice to just like not have to talk to anybody. Yeah, to unplug for a little while. Exactly. Fuck. Oh, God. Fuck. He unplugged right from that, right from, what is it? Pipe. Pipe. Words. <laughs> Things I need to get better at. <laughs> How to just words. But yeah, no, it was like, it was nice to just like have to unplug. Plus, one thing that I really miss, even just about home, um, from like have now currently living just outside of a major city, um, the amount of stars that you can see from like the country or just out in the middle of nowhere is unfucking believable. It is pretty pretty majestic. Because you because you get like just that light pollution from everything, and being able to escape from that is really cool. And just it, it gives you this whole new kind of appreciation for nature. And especially, you know, you get so used to seeing what you grow up around, you know? Yeah. It's like, for the longest time, it's like, oh yeah, the world is just rolling hills and farmland in some cities, but no, like, there's fucking giant mountains out there, and you can go climb, aww, you can, like, go climb all of them, and it was really cool, because, like, when we got up to the top of, of the mountain of Spy Rock, I don't know if you would really call it a mountain, um, but, like, there were just a ton of people up there, and we were all just waiting for, like, the sun to set, and watching the sunset over the mountains is absolutely fucking majestic. If you've never done it, I would highly recommend anybody listening to just go find a mountain and climb it and then just wait until sunset, because it's really cool. Um, I don't know if I can get out of here. Oh. Oh, oh there was a checkpoint right there. Oh. oh duck. But yeah, no, it was an awesome time. It was a lot of fun. Oh, I would good. absolutely do it again. And you and I are still trying to, like, maybe find time to go out to Colorado at some point oh, just because yeah. that's that's a place I've always wanted to go absolutely I mean I've we've planned a lot of trips mm -hmm. um, a lot of them haven't come to fruition mm -hmm. yet not because we haven't wanted them to but yeah you know you and I both work a pretty decent amount and yeah. that was sort of the reason we started this channel was so that we could have something to do together that wasn't work right um, oh that's weird. that's was that that before? No, it was a shroom. Is it like one of, oh, okay. Is it like one of those pity power-ups? Yeah. Probably. Well, it's, so one of the things with Mario Maker is that, like, and I don't know if this is an all-Mario game thing, and I've just never noticed it, but, like, if you program a block to have a fire flower in it, uh -huh. um, and then you, like, you have a mushroom before that, and a player goes to get the fire flower as little Mario and not as mushroom Mario. Oh. It'll just be a mushroom and not a fire flower. So it's like it, it can tell what you already have yeah. and it'll give you what you don't have. Oh. Uh, yes. Yes, it will. <laughs> Fuck. <clears throat> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, don't come back. <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, don't do this to me. <clears throat> <coughs> ah, those are great noises to have on right in your ear drool, ear ear drools, ear holes, ear, ear drools, ear drools, and ear ear drools, ear, ear drools, like eardrums, and ear holes is what I'm trying yeah, to say. Ear drools sounds like a, a really lame Pokemon. 
Uh, oh my oh god. Oh my god. They look ice and side scrollers. Mm -mm, mm -mm. They look like strawberries. What look like strawberries? <laughs> the uh the piranha plants. Especially the ones that like fly out, which I think is coming up. That one. It, it looks like a strawberry. Yeah, okay, a little bit I'll give it to you. <laughs> Man, I am doing incredibly garbage. poorly. Total garbage. Yeah. Shitstorm. Well, I mean, you didn't have to be that. <laughs> Listen, bitch. Okay. Alright, you got this. Here you go. Oh, yeah, so it was a mushroom before. Holy shit. Yeah. Okay. What's in that? Uh, just a coin. Oh, can you not ground pound in this Mario? No. Oh. This is, like, one of my least favorite Marios. What is this, Mario 3? Yeah. Got you. Okay. There you go. Fuck you. Nice. <laughs> All right, we're <laughs> learning. Yep. There we go. Okay. You got this. Is this the farthest you've gotten? No. Oh. This next part is. Okay. Get the coin. Got All it. right. That's good. So then. Oh. oh. Dick me in the butt. There, get the checkpoint at least. Just there dick we. my butt. <laughs> <laughs> Keep the fucking. Oh goodness. Gosh. Oh. Oh, really? Oh, oh, come oh, back. God. Come back. Come back. Okay. Come back. Come back. No! Oh. oh, I hope I didn't need that coin. Yeah, maybe it just leads you to, like, optional shit. Maybe. I don't know. We're about to find out. Oh, my God. I'm not even going to go for the coins anymore. No, there's no point. Because you need all of them to get the key. Yeah. I swear to God. If, if I get to the end of this level and there's a locked door between uh... me and the fucking flag... I will I'll be, be I'll be so furious. mad. Oh, okay. I don't like auto scroll levels. Oh my god. Because it it forces you to progress at a certain rate. Yeah. You can't like fly through it because you're good. You have to play by what the game. Oh my god, there's another checkpoint. Jeez. Dude, honestly, there's not like which that could already screw you over if you don't have all the coins and you're supposed to. Yeah. Cuz then you basically have nothing but death awaiting you. There is honestly nothing that I like about side scrolling levels. Mm -mm. Oh god. This is this is a oh. This is this. a really good boss battle. Yeah, I I'm, like I really like I hate this level cuz it keeps dicking me over, but I this is a really good level. It's an interesting concept, yeah. Oh my gosh. Are they going to keep getting higher cuz the last one was two? Oh, sweet. Okay, there's a door. Please don't dick us. Oh, oh, are you kidding me? I don't know, I bet he has another key. Oh, yeah, maybe. My guess is... Is if you don't get all of them, you can beat him. Yeah, and, and he gives you, you a key. Get all of them. That would make sense. At okay. least that's my hope. Just need one more hit on it. Shit. Oh, come on. You got it. Just don't get hit by the fire. Yes! Oh, yes, you were right. Thank God. Sweet. Yeah, because if I be needed the all end. the coins at that part, I would be really... What? Um... I'm so concerned. Oh, thank God. Oh, oh yes! See. So you can only get the one up if you get all the coins. I see. Okay. Whew! Okay. Well, that was really fun. Yeah. Well, I like that. That was a good level. Mm -hmm. You also deserve a comment, friend. <laughs> Whatever your name was. Was um, this Lyon? No. This was Fat Fatty. Fatty H. Uh, Fatty's H. Oh, Fatty's H. Fatty sh Star. Piranha Ice Passage. And comment. Lead me to victory! <laughs> <laughs> uh, All right, yeah. that's it. We'll see you next time on the links. <laughs>